every day? So we bought every day. It was every day. And uh, that's all I knew was the Jesus. block. Mm-hmm. Uh, I moved down here. I hated it. Because you know, I was like, oh, I'm going back on the streets. You no, know, it's too quiet down here. I don't know nobody. <laughs> Everybody extra crunchy. I ain't with it. <laughs> so it was just like, I want to go home because I'm going so. crazy here. You know? And um, start going to church. At first it was just like, all right, you know, he preaching. I'm not going to do the same thing anyway. <clears throat> but find somebody who sell weed. I'm going to get back on it. I don't care what nobody said. So it was just like, I was that kind of person. I didn't care about nothing because nobody never cared about me. Mm-hmm. You know, and, um, I found uh, I met Bishop. That's when I started dancing. Mm-hmm. I, I met Bishop, and you know, as much as I drifted away, you know, he was still there to help me get back on one accord with God as well and His salvation that He had for me, He had for us. Mm-hmm. So it was just like I thank you. I thank Bishop for being there for, to show me who Jesus was. And I also thank Mom because little did she know, like, she didn't only do something for me. It's for half the East Coast, you know. She mostly be behind the scenes on stuff, but a lot of people don't acknowledge and realize how much she did you know, without even knowing it like she did so much for me without even knowing it. all these crazy events all of everything you know it's been happening and I just I also thank you for that you know because you, you did a lot a lot for me and that shows how, how strong you are and how, how willing you are to God's word and how to God's will so I, I thank you so so much like I know I, I wrote you this but I was like you know what if I say it it'll it come out better you know I wanted to express to you tell you in front of your face but it's like she did so much for a lot of people without even knowing you know, a lot of people just be like oh look go here and do this and it's just like she made a lot of things happen a lot of a lot of people. Half of this East Coast, half of this corrupt stuff, a lot, you know. I just thank Bishop for being here also, you know, for ministering to the youth, keeping us together because a lot of this stuff wouldn't be happening either if it wasn't these two people, you know, keeping everything together how it was, how it is. And it's just like, I just thank y'all for this. I mean, look at y'all's real family, you know. Even when I thought, shoot, I don't have no family. My family is this blunt. This is all I got. This is, yeah, come on, just blow this down and chill. Because I don't care about nothing. I don't care about nobody. And um, they made me really realize, you know, that I do have family. Because I just stay at the house. I've been sitting at their house and it's just like the craziest things be happening in their house. <laughs> It'd be the craziest things and I'd just be like I would have never seen stuff like this in my life. Like, it'd be crazy. It'd be funny but it'd be just be crazy like I just be like, what is going on? But it's, it's it's a great feeling because it's like I'm around good people. And Amen. I was never ever ever around good people, and I would have never thought I would be this person today. Because I used to be bang, bang, just do it all. Because I didn't care about my life. But it was just like I'm just glad that I'm around people. I spoke to Jazz for about two hours this morning. Wow. You know? <laughs> I never spoke to Jazz that long in my life. 
I was supposed to for two whole hours. And I was just looking at this fuck is two hours that go past. You're about to go to church. You're still sitting in sweatpants. What are you doing? But, you know, I just think thank God for like people for, for him putting real family in my life. You know, I could sit and talk to somebody for two hours, you know, and, and get to know Jazz, you know, she let me get to know her. No reason. I was. I, was <laughs> I used to be that person. Amen. Amen. I used to be that. Because I didn't care about nobody. I had no remorse for nobody. I just didn't care. But I'm just glad that, you know, Bishop stayed on my head because he was on my head. All stuff like the first time I met him, I came to him. His event, high as crap. <laughs> <laughs> and he was just looking at me, and I was high. I danced, and I got high. <laughs> Again, like right, right in front of his face, I was high as crap. Look, what's up? I was high. I stayed at his house for about a month, two, that same summer, and it cha- changed everything. It changed everything about my, my mindset, it changed the, the way I walk. Change the way I talk to people, how I acknowledge people. And it's just like, it's crazy how, because I didn't believe in God and, and what He can do at first. And now I'm just so full of His will. I believe in His salvation. My God. Thank you, Lord. My God. Amen. I just thank, I just thank y'all for doing everything that y'all have done up until this point. Amen. 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 Amen.